Right, I'm going to show you two different small gunny sacks here. One loaded to 16 kilograms that I use for like sort of hybrid club kettlebell cell stuff, but still having a unique Sam flail feel. And I've got one loaded up here to 45 kilograms, pretty heavy. Now I'm going to show you how it works really good for like scaled down strongman compound um, sort of stuff. So yeah, I'll show you this one first. Yeah, 16 kilos, so I'm going to do like kettlebell, club, mace style stuff with this. It's quite heavy for having this um, non-structured handle, it's flexible, so the weight is emphasised. You don't need a lot of weight, like swings. Go straight to swipes. Power swipes. Straight into hammer swings, my favourite. Switch. Then you can do standard stuff like pressing, especially nice in the hand. And you get these dynamic, makes up complexes. Yeah, a small one. You catch my breath for a sec here. Load up to 45 kilos. So, a pretty obvious one that I like to do. Because of the shape of this, it's already mirrors your body shape, so it's great for rows. Really good for rows, and then from there, like you got the cleans. Yep. Go. Then you just drop it. Back up. Naturally, from there, you got squats. And then from there, you can shoulder it. I like to do this. Then go back down. Back up. And from there, shoulder it. Squats and lunges. Loaded carries. Lunges, squats, walking carries, walking lunges. So that's a workout. That's not crazy heavy. Forty-five kilograms. It could load up to probably like sixty-five. But that's a workout. The last one. Front squats is the most challenging with these things. So, I sort of load it up, get up and spin it, front squat. and easy. So yeah, small gunny sack, two different ways and you can load it incrementally between them to do whatever you want.